you saw the direction that the uh, wheel starts in. So with that in mind, you'll, you'll know that when the uh, O-ring is on here, that the tension will be on the top side. Doesn't matter what the camera looks like because of the frame rate, it can make it stop, look like it's going the other direction, whatever. Go on to the other side. Not on the rotary cable because I'm not going to go through that trouble. And uh, this gives me an opportunity to try a couple things. I, I don't have any uh, video of this in high definition, so it gives me a chance to zoom in on a couple little spots like that and see how it looks. What I'm going to do is take the uh, little burner out from underneath it. And if you listen, you can hear it slowing down. I think we all agree on that. Nothing coming up through the table to make it run. Somebody wanted to see an extended run time to make sure that the uh, little DC motor in the generator wasn't running the thing or that if there wasn't something hidden on the other side out of sight that was making it run. So you can see it's almost stopped. We put the burner back underneath. Takes a little while to heat up. Here we go. So I hope that convinces everybody that there isn't anything fake about how the motor is running. It gives me a chance to try another experiment, otherwise I wouldn't waste my time. Okay, this is the uh, direction that the flywheel turns. So that means that as this is running, the top side of the O-ring will be the uh, tightened side. So let's give it a go. Here it's speeding up. Going pretty good now. I, I actually oiled the bearings a little bit before I started this second run. And uh, here's what I wanted to show you. I needed something to make this a little bit more fun, so I actually hooked the uh, window motor up to the generator. <clears throat> I'm not sure what it proves, but it just makes a nice video. The uh, rotor is about two pounds. And it's running on uh, the little Bedini Coal half wave circuit. Plug into the little generator down there. Notice the top side of the uh, O ring is a little bit tighter than the bottom. I'm enjoying using this uh, Panasonic PM700 camera. And uh, I convert the files to 1080 by 720 MP4 before editing and posting the video.
how to smooth this rotary cable, but maybe if I had roller skates on. You may have seen this running here in the background. <laughs> this is uh, part of what you saw going in an earlier experiment. This window motor here is running from this little cell, a battery, or whatever you want to call it. It's made from a pipe, a copper pipe, with a sham, wow, chamois wrapped around it. Uh, I think you know what a sham wow is. So I'm going to call this the dad wow, and that's no sham. Sorry about that. <laughs> But anyhow, uh, these uh, magnesium windings are touching, and we were never sure that that was a good idea or not, but it seems to work. The little cell's running at uh, 1.37 volts, sort of, and so I've got all these things running here for very little energy. And that's about it.